teachers who received their licenses um, in 2019 are now having to renew. It's five years later. Um, so we, by our accounts, estimate that there's some 2,300 teachers. It's it's in that range. I'm sorry, I don't have the exact number, but it's a number in that range. Um, about 2,300 teachers across the country who will have their licenses expiring August 31st, 2024. Uh, what we've seen from our work is that um, we have about 2,100 of those teachers who have completed the requirements and their licenses have been renewed and processed. It's like 88% of them. There's another group um, that's about 9%. I think it's something like 200 or so or a little bit less. Those are in process still. Um, they're either uh, being reviewed still or the teachers are completing the 120 hour assignment or for whatever reason, those are in process. From the numbers that we have, the indication that we have, there's only about 3% of teachers who have not um, submitted applications for their license renewal at this time. We've been working in collaboration with the BNTU. They've been very consistent in updating their surveys and sending to us at the ministry the lists of teachers who have questions, um, concerns regarding the reports that they've gotten from the TLI or, or not gotten from the TLI. So that with the list of names that we get from the BNTU, our respective units are doing the reviews and the checks so that we make sure that if there's if there's something that we're missing, um, but the union is getting feedback from that particular teacher that we're trying to respond to ensure that we're um, we're responding to the needs.